Hey everyone, today we will go over pictures of the well-awaited twin otter from Aerosoft, which is still in development, uh, which actually makes me happy that it's still in development. And if you stay till the end, I will explain why that is. So a couple months ago I purchased the Britain Norman Islander with much excitement. Well, that honeymoon phase is over. With bad textures and unrealistic flight characteristics, I was left with a void. So if you stay tuned, I'll explain later why I, I'm so excited that they're taking so long. Well now, we have the Twin Otter, which I think will be the replacement aircraft for island hopping, uh, which is what I'm currently enjoying now. Uh, the Twin Otter is a Canadian stall aircraft. Stall meaning short takeoff and landing. So here I have a couple of pictures that I want to share with you, starting with this beautiful sunset uh, with this blue twin otter. So the team at Aerosoft has already been playing around with it in the sim. Here's a closer shot. Looks like it's uh, either arriving or it's about to take off. Here's a neat picture of the interior. Uh, this is going to be pretty fun, especially for uh, cargo flying. This one's going to be fun to add a FedEx livery to the Twin Otter and just fly around island hopping. Here's another picture of the interior as the plane is taking off. And as I look at the textures, they look really nice. I can't wait to have this in hand. And here's another shot of the interior with those unique looking yokes. In the forum, someone from Aerosoft was asking whether we wanted to have a co-pilot, and of course everyone said yes. What are your guys' thoughts? Does he look Canadian? These next two shots are recent and show the current progress of the project. Here's a shot of a twin otter in the water landing configuration, which looks absolutely beautiful. And this one's exciting. It's showing some of the liveries that will come with the plane. Here's a shot of the Twin Otter at the Lukla Airport. Here we're seeing the passenger configuration, which looks really nice. Here's one of the liveries that they're going to offer. It's going to have a shark face. Here's another nice detail of an interior compartment. really looking forward to the Twin Otter from Aerosoft. One of the main reasons why I'm really excited about this aircraft is because their development time has taken quite a while. Because they're taking so long with the development, I know they're going to produce a very high quality aircraft. Unlike the Britain Norman, I have a feeling it was produced very quickly and the results just kind of show it. It doesn't really feel realistic to me when I fly it. So this will fill that void that I was so excited about for the Britain Norman. Now it will come with the Twin Otter. Later this week I will provide more news about the Twin Otter, so if you're interested in this topic, Please leave a like and subscribe if you want to. Alrighty, well have a nice one. Bye bye.